Well, KSI, mm. we go again. Yes. You return after nearly three years out of the yep. ring. How did it come about? Uh, well, Jake Paul, that was it. Like, uh, I saw how everyone was doing with the whole boxing scene, and especially on the YouTube boxing scene, and I saw Jake Paul just, just on everyone, thinking he's the saying this and that. It's a lot of coming from him, so. Oh, wait, this is, can I swear? Uh, <laughs> I totally forgot. That's all right. We've got a couple of beeps. But okay. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> uh, my bad. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, I felt like I needed to come back and uh, show everyone that he's a fraud and uh, show everyone that I can destroy him easily. I mean, you boxed a couple of times, started off at the Copper Box. Yes. The fight that I was involved with, actually. I've been, I've been involved in a lot of your career, if we go back to... Yeah, yeah, Jake, Joe Weller, Joe you, Weller. Showed, you showed good boxing skills, and then we had the fight with Logan, Logan Paul yeah. over here up in Manchester, which was equally as good, and then mm. that one over in the States. Yeah, stay with Why did you come away from boxing and, and, and then decide to come back? I know you said because you're seeing how Jake's well, up, your career's unfolded. For me... I can't, so I, I left because I felt like I'd accomplished what I wanted to accomplish. I wanted to beat Logan Paul and show everyone that I could do it. You know, I was a heavy underdog for both fights, but I showed that, yes, I have the, the, the dog and the, 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 the heart to win that fight. So then I came off, I was like, all right, I want to focus on my music. I want to, you know, make sure that my music is really popping because I felt like, uh, musically, I needed to create more of a foundation of uh, where where was that uh, musically, and you know, just work on making better music. You know, work on you know better songs. Just constantly improving my graph. But while I was doing all of that, I was still working on my boxing. I was still making sure that I. So you're still training. Yeah. So I still was. For me, I was. I I hate watching back the Logan Paul. KSI fight. I hate the second one. I hate it. It's just, I, I cringe at it because it's just, there was no technique. The boxing technique was out the window. It was scrappy. It was rough. And I, it just wasn't what I wanted it to be. And, you know, for me, I trained, I trained, but I clearly didn't train enough. I didn't understand it enough to know what punches to do, what things to do. Whereas now, you know, throughout the time that I would had gone off, you know, the three years that I was just doing music and then training, I was working on my balance. I was working on my skills. I was working on why I was punching, why I was throwing the jab, why I'm changing my angles, why I'm going orthodox. All right, now I'm going southpaw. Why I'm using that to my advantage. Why I'm staying on the outside foot whenever I go southpaw, et cetera. Things like this, like before I didn't understand boxing, I was just like, oh, you just punch. And then if you can, land a big punch you win but now it's like okay I you know I can really work piece up an opponent and be smarter with how I attack certain opponents you know styles make fights and certain styles you know are my kryptonite as well as certain uh, certain styles are my bread and butter so you know I'm just constantly working and working to improve so that when it comes to boxing styles I'm able to deal with all of them. So you've been working on your boxing technique and your boxing IQ. You always had that strength and that rawness about yeah, you, but yeah. now you've now been I, polishing I, up. Yeah, exactly. I don't need to rely on that now. Now I can actually just focus on me being a good boxer and knocking people out because I haven't fully knocked or went out clean, you know, throughout my boxing um, journey. I've, you know, TKO'd and, you know, won a decision, but I haven't actually knocked someone out. So... Yeah, I want to start knocking people out. Let's move on to the 27th of August, Saturday mm. night. Yes. You've, you've decided to come back after nearly three years, but not with one opponent, but mm. two. You always seem to do something a little different. And with these two opponents, Swarms, who's not boxed so much, he's a rapper, yeah, who's not done yeah. so much boxing. But you're, a you're, lot of talk. <laughs> your second opponent, to your credit, yes. is a Mexican. Yes. So you know yeah, it's going to no, be tough. No, I know and he's a tough. professional boxer. Of course. So you've chose a serious opponent for the second one. Yeah, and for, so with Swarms, you know, he called me out, said he would smoke me, said he would destroy me. So, you know, I called him out on his BS and uh, I was like, all right, cool, let's go. And then I felt like I still needed to push myself more. And that's why I decided to do two fights and then fight a pro boxer to show Jake Paul, to Jake Paul, that I'm serious about this. And I fought, Jake, uh, I fought a pro boxer before Jake Paul mm. and he's had three plus years uh, opportunity to do that so with me I'm very serious with this and uh, yeah I chose a guy who has had 
50 plus fights, amateur amateur fights, uh, has had a decent amount of pro box, uh, boxing fights, and uh, yeah, has the experience. And for me, you know, he's he's young. He's about 23. He still has a lot more to do, a lot more to give. And I kind of want to just show everyone that I'm serious about this and that I'm going to knock people out. And you know, if I can do it to a pro boxer, then I can do it to Jake Paul. And I know that's a fight that you want now. You've had the fights with Logan Paul. You look, you're looking at fighting his brother, Jake, down the road. But the question I want to ask you, mm. KSI, is yes, that's great. You're chasing that fight, and that would be a huge fight. Yeah, yeah. But moving on from that, looking outside of that, what would the roadmap be? Would you, you know, do you want to take professional boxing seriously? Is it like... Would your long-term goal to be to try and win a title in professional boxing, or is it that you're just chasing that Jake Ball fight? I think for me, it's like, with me, I always just base it on certain goals. I have certain goals in mind, and once I get those goals, then I decide at the time. Uh, so right now, yeah, I, I all I'm focused focused on is Jake Paul but after you never know like if I want to have a super fight with uh, Mayweather or McGregor cool if I want to try and get a title fight with a nut, like a pro pro boxer that that's all they do etc why not like it's one of those things where it's kind of based on me and whatever sure. I want to focus on I know if I put my mind to anything and if I focus on it I'm going to get it I'm so. going to throw a name to you okay professional boxer his brother's super super famous don't say it better be ev <laughs> no no, <laughs> okay. no 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 his brother's uh, super super famous it's a fight oh it's gonna happen tommy yeah. fury tommy fury yeah, no, so that, is like, that a name that you oh yeah i'm definitely down to fight in tommy fury yeah 100 yeah, percent. i so, feel like so i don't i, I don't want to say too much but like for me like that could make sense for my next fight after the 20 something wow you're looking yeah. as soon as that but i mean ex like there's obviously other names, but Tommy Fury is one of the names, yeah. Brilliant. I just, yeah, I don't want to... I, I don't like, wanna... uh, no, I'm liking that, mate. I'm liking that. <laughs> Listen, wanna... KSI, thanks so much for your time. And basket, um, but... I'm looking forward to continuing the journey with you. Yes, it's been of a, It's been a bit of a, bit oh, of a bro, ride for I us, mean, you know? And it will continue to be a ride. Whenever you go up on the KSI journey, bro, you know it. it is a roller coaster. Wicked. Well done, bro. <laughs> Thank you, man. Nice. <laughs> <Got you. laughs>